1900 days in you know what time it is it's time for your boy to show my account once again i do this every 100 days i won't go in too much detail if you want to see my first ever which was 1500 i'll link it at the end of the video but for now let's see how i did so let's go for my overall stats this is my highest power i've ever been not gonna lie i'm pretty fat and I'm hoping for this KVK to actually really trim down to below 75 around that mark. My kill points, it's the only thing I'm really now really working on. I think I've done everything else I wanted. So from now on, it's just KP, KP, and more KP. So you can see my stats. Decent amount of deaths. Uh, very low resource gathered. For this amount of time but it is what it is let's go see my commander view this is what i use i use this in arc cyrus as an obelisk runner and i use mostly infantry around i got around four million troops uh pretty much half and half in t4 and t5 i use t4s now fully to fight an open field and i use the t5s for reinforcing rallies garrisons and for arc of osiris i don't train siege i think it's a waste of my time any more siege i have to actually complete for, for an event i usually delete right after i don't want to have more than just one full march moving on see the achievements here quickly i got most of them most that i actually wanted so for now on, I don't really want to push it. And uh, if you notice, I got some more resources compared to my last video. And that's because I literally opened most of my resources before the video. Just so I can prepare for tomorrow's. I mean, the pass opens today, but I won't make it today. So preparing for tomorrow. This is what I have speed ups i think i'm good enough with speed ups i usually have a, a way more way more speed ups than resources so that's why i use the force so less resources but more speed ups costed got four boosts i usually buy the boost from the courier shop for 1500 gems equipment we'll see on the commanders and armaments as well this is what i have in my other tab decent amount of everything but yeah so let's go quickly to the commanders this is my cavalry march i run one cavalry two infantry one archer and one leadership i run the four piece set uh i'm pretty happy with it i got lucky with the good pieces with the health and as for the armaments this is the best armament setup in my account overall really happy with it we will quickly go over it. Hunter, my best armament. This one is also pretty good. This one, I really, it's a shame I can't script it yet, but I really want to. And this one is the one I'm currently working on to actually improve. So yeah, that is cavalry. Let's go on to my main infantry, which is the one I'm currently working on the most. Currently working to. To craft the KVK hammer. I'm not that far behind. I'm using a two piece bonus. I'm using the Eternal Knight and Shields because I can easily upgrade them through the Lost Kinnon shop. And it's actually not that bad. Armaments wise, it could be better. A lot of health from descriptions as well. But compared to the calorie, it is kind of lacking and there is a lot of room for improvement, which is in a way kind of nice. Respite is a very good inscription to have on the open field. This one also has no inscription like the Nevsky one. And this one is pretty decent as well, but could be a lot better. But shame that I'm left without any more chances to improve it. Second infantry march. This is the one I'm, I really haven't done much work since I got this done. And... Uh, and the reports it also kind of shows I one does not get really good trades. And you can look at the armaments as well, you can see why. It's not as good as my first one. 
and there's also a lot of room for improvement but i'll get there Leadership, leadership is going to be in a weird spot, but this is what I have right on. I'm going to work on getting the four piece legendary set, which gives me some skill damage reduction, some more march speeds, I believe, and some troop health. So we'll see how about Trajan. I use pair him with uh, Mulan. And I'll talk about my setup marches in just a second. So we got one more march to go. Actually, I forgot the armaments here. Let me quickly glance over them. I really haven't upgraded them in a long, long time. I just tried to get a lot of these inscriptions, which apply to all troop types. Because it's I use a mixed march with this. That is the reason. Bodica. I'm going for the full dragon set. Currently working on the pants and then the boots. And we'll see. We'll see what I do next. As for the armaments, they're actually not that bad because I have a lot of inscriptions, but also there's a lot of room to improve as well, which is, like I said, encouraging because there is a chance. And I got kind of lucky with the double inscription and to have a double stat, not hopefully get lucky to get even higher or triple stat. And there we go. As for the actual marches, let's see if I can actually, let's actually do it in Expedition. It's easy. So, let's do it like this. Skippy Aliuche, Devsky William, Trajan Mulan, next, Burika Zuge. After I max Zuge, I'll put him primary, so it's going to be Zuge Burika. And go on Sargon. It's not at full capacity yet because Suge is not yet maxed, but overall, I think I could do some damage here. And uh, overall, I've been pretty satisfied with the whole setup, but if I could go back, I would probably do more cavalry rather than infantry. But it's kind of too late for me to switch. As for the actual Suge progression, he's the current commander I'm working on. And uh, he is, I put a skill on him yesterday, so I'm still missing like around 160 heads to get to the finish line. And after that, I don't know, I'll probably save up for the next calorie to replace my William, maybe, or maybe work on the leadership to replace Mulan, but I don't think so. And uh, currently, I do have one farm account that I'm kind of running, and it gave me like 100 million gold, a little bit less. So that's the only farm I have. I won't go into it, but I'll show you real quick. It's this. I just log in, send the march to the gold pit, send all other marches for gold as well, and that's it. Log in once a day. No really effort to make it higher or better. Just just trying to get as many resources as I can from the only really farm that I have. The things you see here are basically failed projects. Like me in the past, I maybe tried to work in the off season on a farm or a new account, but I, I just couldn't be bothered to actually do it consistently. And uh, yeah, pass opens today. Like I said, I won't make it. So tomorrow, tune in. I'll be streaming most likely in the evening so you can see my arches and my gameplay in action. Thank you guys for watching. I'll put the link to my first ever video about rock in top part of the screen right now. And I'll see you guys in the next one.